Don't forget to subscribe and click on bell icon, so that you will not miss another update. The most destructive wildfire, raging in Southern, California, has expanded significantly, scorching an area larger, than New York City. The Thomas Fire, in Ventura, and Santa Barbara, counties has consumed 230,000 acres, in the past week. Fanned by strong winds, it has become the fifth largest wildfire, in recorded state history after it grew by more than 50,000 acres in a day. Residents in coastal beach, communities, have been ordered to leave. On Sunday, firefighters, reported that 15% of the blaze, had been contained but were forced to, downgrade, that to 10% as it continued to spread. Santa Barbara, County, Sheriff Bill, Brown said that, this is a menacing fire, certainly, but we have a lot of people working very diligently, to bring it under control. The other fires hitting, California, are largely controlled, but 200,000 people have evacuated, their homes and hundreds of buildings have been destroyed since 4 December. Evacuation, orders were issued overnight on Sunday, for parts of, Carpinteria, close to Los, Padres, National Forest, about 100 miles northwest of Los Angeles. Forecasters, said wind speeds were expected to increase throughout the day, before dying down again overnight. The local fire department, tweeted, pictures of a wall of flames, advancing on homes on the outskirts, of Carpinteria, early on Sunday morning. Meanwhile, actor, Rob, Lowe, who lives in Santa Barbara, a city of close to 100,000 people, tweeted that he was praying for his town as fires closed in. Firefighters, making brave stands. Could go either way. Packing to evacuate now, Lowe added. California, has spent the past seven days battling wildfires. Six large blazes, and other smaller ones, erupted, on Monday night in Southern California. The Thomas Fire, named according to where it started, near the Thomas Aquinas College, is by far the largest of the fires. They swept through, tens of thousands of acres in a matter of hours, driven by extreme weather, including low humidity, high winds and parched ground. The authorities, issued a purple alert, the highest level warning, amid what it called extremely critical fire weather, while US President, Donald Trump, declared a state of emergency. On Saturday, California Governor, Jerry Brown, described the situation as the new normal and predicted vast fires, fueled by climate change, could happen every year or every few years. Several firefighters, have been injured, but only one person has died, a 70-year-old woman who was found dead in her car on an evacuation route. There are also fears, the blaze will, seriously hit, California's multi-million dollar agricultural industry. What's your take on this? Do share your views via comment section below. And like always do not forget to like and share this video and subscribe the channel, I will be back shortly with another news, till then have a great time ahead, bye bye.